Magandang araw po sa inyong lahat. Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back po sa ating YouTube channel. Ang problem natin for today ay mula sa Hydraulics and Geotechnical Engineering. And ang problem na ito ay isang passport problem na lumabas noong April 2023 and lumabas din ito noong May 2016. Okay, let's start. A trapezoid canal has a bottom width of 4 meters and a side slope of 2 horizontal and 1 vertical. Okay, ito ang kanyang bottom base na 4 meters and ito naman ang kanyang side slope na 2 horizontal and 1 vertical. When the depth of flow is 1.2 meters, the flow is 30 cubic meter per second. The roughness coefficient is 0 0.015. And ito naman ang kanyang depth na 1.2 meters and ang kanyang discharge na 30 cubic meter per second. And ito naman ang hinahanap, ang pangutana. Evaluate the slope of the channel using Manning's formula. So ito ang ating slope na hinahanap. Slope of the canal or slope of channel bed. Okay, so proceed muna tayo dito sa pag-identify or pag-complete ng dimension nitong trapezoid canal natin. So, ito ang top width, hindi natin alam and ito naman ang kanyang side na Y. Okay, so draw tayo dito ng line perpendicular sa ating bottom base para makagawa tayo ng rectangular shape. So, kung 4 meter, meters dito, so 4 meters din ito sa itaas. And itong, itong mga missing length, ito naman ang ating hahanapin. So, equal lang itong dalawa. So, sige, proceed tayo dito sa x. So, i-isolate natin ito and masusolve natin ang x by ratio and proportion. So, horizontal, which is x, divided by the vertical na d is equal to 2 horizontal and 1 vertical. Okay, so itong 1.2 i-transpose natin dito yan sa kabila para maging 2 times 1.2 meter and ang ating x or ang missing length natin is 2.4 meters. And proceed naman tayo dito sa ating y dito sa side. So, pag in-isolate natin yan, makakabuo tayo ng right triangle. And ito ang kanyang side, 2.4 at saka 1.2 na depth. So, ito naman y, ito ang kanyang hypotenuse. So, by Pythagorean theorem, ito ay masusold natin ang y. So, yan. Okay, ang ating y or ang ating in inclined na side, side is 2.68 meters. And, yun, kom nakompleto na natin ito. Kaya, kunin na natin ang top width. So, top width natin is b plus dalawang x. Top width natin ay 8.8 .8 meters. Ayan. Nakompleto na natin ang ating dimension. Kaya proceed na tayo sa ating main na goal dito. Which is slope of the canal. So, according dito sa problem, ang gagamitin daw natin na formula is formula ng Manning's or Manning's formula or velocity of flow. So, ang problema natin dito is wala pa tayong 
velocity of flow. And wala pa rin tayong hydraulic radius. So, since binigyan tayo ng discharge, so gagamitin muna natin ang formula ng discharge. Okay, so formula ng discharge is cross-sectional area divided by or times the velocity flows. Okay, so cross-sectional area times the velocity flow. So solvin muna natin itong cross-sectional area. Cross-sectional area natin ay 7.68 square meters. Okay, yan. And, okay, dito naman tayo focus sa formula ni Mannings. So, R dito is unknown. So, formula ng R or ang hydraulic radius ay cross-sectional area divided by the weighted perimeter. So, weighted perimeter is dalawang Y plus isang bottom base. Okay, so, itong equation na ito, is lagay natin dito yan, sa hydraulic radius. And then, ito namang equation ng hydraulic radius, ilagay naman natin dito sa formula ng velocity flow. Okay? So, and lastly, itong velocity of flow formula or equation, ilagay naman natin dito sa formula ng ating discharge. Okay, para isang compute na lang natin. So, mapapansin natin dito, isa na lang ang unknown which is itong target natin na slope. Okay, so, let's compute. Okay. Slope ng ating channel ay 0.00447. And ito na ang ating final answer. Yan, problem solved mga kapatid. A trapezoidal canal has a bottom width of 4 meters and side slope of 2 horizontal to 1 vertical. When the depth of the flow is 1.2 meters, the flow is 35 cubic meter per second. The roughness coefficient is 0.015. Evaluate the slope of the channel using Manning's formula.